Hello YouTubers, bringing you a little review on another lifesaver. I reviewed the boulder tools that I use to repair the tires, but not the compressor that I use. I use this Craftsman compressor. I've used it quite a bit. This thing is really awesome. Um, with the addition of the Craftsman battery, the batteries do not come with it. This is a two amp. I highly recommend going with the two amp battery. Um, that may have been a Cheez-It that you saw. These Buffalo wing Cheez-Its, these are awesome. These are completely awesome. You gotta try these if you haven't tried them. They're a trip. If you like regular Cheez-Its, who doesn't like Cheez-Its? But the Buffalo wing, amazing. All right, so back to the Craftsman. This thing is way, way cool. The goofy part of it, let's get it out of the way. It's this cord. That's the whole electric cord. And it says don't use an extension. So forget about it. Anyway, the way to use this is with the rechargeable battery. Or I've also used it with the adapter that's included. And don't really know what this other stuff is in here. If somebody knows, point it out. I don't use it. I think it's for, um, it may be for pumping up uh, sports equipment or whatever the case may be. There's also, it comes with a couple um, tubes that go into here, which is your, this thing right here outputs air as well. I don't use it for that, but you can. You can inflate like a raft or uh, air mattress. DC and AC operation, really easy, simple switch. Power on, power off. Um, one of these is, yeah, the top is like, that's for your tires. Down here, your airflow comes out of here. So, pretty simple, pretty easy. I'll show you what it looks like when it's hooked up to the battery. It does have an auto shut off. Let me show you actually where the battery is. In case you're wondering, that's the back. There's your stats, probably a serial number on there. And this right here is where your battery goes on all the Craftsman tools. They have a hookup like that. See those four little prongs that go in there. These batteries are really sweet. The two amp ones, don't get the other ones. These last a while on this compressor. A lot, of, you can do all your tires on like one battery level. And that's at three. Get yourself the, um, the nice charger. That goes with this guy and the 2 amp, at least a 2 amp, but you can go for more. So the lithium ion, real good luck with these. I use these in the, um, the weed cleaner and I use them in the blower. So I got that set. I'll show you that some other time. This slides on the back. Number your batteries, I do. So you have a number of batteries. Just put a number on them so you know which one's which. That way, if you have any issues, see how it locked in? Locks in solid, it's nice. If you have any issues with your batteries and you have them marked, now you know. Set, it does have auto cutoff. I think I did mention that. That's important. It actually goes a pound over about, and then it levels out. Um, it's got PSI, and you just keep going up by one increments. It measures by the 0.5s. So it'll measure your tire by 0.5. As soon as you put the, this guy right here, you're gonna put this on your tire. It's nice actually. Okay, it's not high tech, high speed, but it actually works really, really well this. I like this piece. Good, go all the way onto your, the valve stem of your tire. Once you get it on there, Push this all the way down, and that's going to lock it. When you're done filling up, flip it up, and this thing will pop right off real quick. You won't lose any air pressure. Nice design. This guy right here, I think the center piece, I don't ever mess with it. I leave it in PSI. But if you wanted to do bar, hold on, give me bar. That's bar. I don't know if you, you can't see it. It's hiding for some reason from the camera, but it says bar to the right of that. So it's got PSI and it's got bar. 
Maybe if I get further away. Don't know. Camera doesn't like it. PSI and bar. That's your going up. Going up. So that'd be like 7 PSI, 6 PSI. Obviously, you're not going to fill anything with 6 PSI not on cars anyway. That's your bar, and it does kilopascal too. KPAs. Never use those. Well, your tire should be marked PSI and bar at least, I believe. Maybe Canada uses uh, BAR. All right, DC, AC, and that's it. I mean, this thing, this thing's a tank. It is awesome. Um, carry one of these with you. You'll be happy. The one thing I don't like about it, and I don't know if this times out, is this stays on when your battery's in. So I recommend to you the way I carry it in my car is I carry it all together like this. The other cord doesn't wrap up as well for some reason. I carry it without the battery loaded. So keep that battery, one or two of them in your car. Don't let them get too hot in your trunk. It's not good for the battery. Keep this, keep this kit. I don't know, it, this really doesn't even get that hot when you use it. I'm amazed actually by this compressor. It's really decent, really good. Um, I think that's an outlet. I don't use that for anything, but that's the side of it. Yeah, the Craftsman. Fantastic piece. Really, really happy with it. Keeps me out of trouble. And that way you can have more time to consume buffalo wing Cheez-Its. Also outstanding. So, thanks Craftsman. If you need a good compressor, grab one of these. Highly recommended. Don't forget your batteries. It's going to cost you more. I don't want to give you the prices. You might cry. But... As far as a portable compressor, it is outstanding. Good luck. Happy 4th.